By the age of 19, I was living with a guy who was involved in a motorcycle club. We were arrested for dealing drugs. He uh, asked if I would marry him in hopes that it would keep him from going to prison. It didn't work. I was convicted of a gross misdemeanor conspiracy to obtain a controlled substance and paid a fine. After a year, he was released and we went right back doing the same old thing. One of my responsibilities at the club was to pay off our drug connections with sex. I found myself pregnant. My husband did not like children, didn't want children. They didn't fit into our lifestyle. And I didn't want to tell my mom and my family I was pregnant by someone I didn't know who the father was. The only thing I could think of is to have an abortion. The day I went to the abortion clinic, my girlfriend went with me. While we were in the room, waiting for the doctor and the assistant to come in, my friend needed to use the restroom. And so I was there in the room alone. God gave me that chance to uh, ask for forgiveness because I knew what I was doing was wrong. But I just felt so hopeless. And uh, I put my hand on my stomach. I said, baby, I'm so sorry I have to kill you. I just don't know what else to do. And right then the, the doctor and the assistant came in, my friend came in. And it was done and it was finished. After it was finished, I just felt so empty and so numb. It wasn't long after that, I started becoming very angry and resentful. Didn't like anything about where I was at in my situation. So in nine months, I left the club and divorced my husband. About a year after that, some things uh, stirred in my heart. God just totally started working on my heart. And I gave my life to Christ. And I had some friends that invited me to come to church with them, so I did. One Sunday, a the local crisis pregnancy center uh, announced that they were having a grand opening and everybody was invited. So I went and I felt God just tugging on my heart to tell them about my abortion. I went through the post-abortion counseling class to learn how to forgive myself because see God had already forgiven me so I became a crisis pregnancy counselor started um, helping those uh, turning my life to use for good I was making a difference in people's lives what the enemy meant for evil God used for good God wanted me to share my scar